Welcome everyone to Kane University, where cougars climb higher to achieve their dreams. This public research university is known as one of the most diverse in the Northern United States and recognized for helping students from all backgrounds succeed and graduate. Located here in Union, New Jersey, just minutes from the career and entertainment hub in Manhattan, Kane has a story you'll wanna hear. I'm your host, Alex Spoilin, and over the next half hour, we're gonna travel around this beautiful campus to meet real students going to Kane right now, along with some incredible alumni. We'll hear stories from aspiring actors, scientists, entrepreneurs, and architects. The passion these students and alumni have for this university is absolutely contagious. Welcome to Kane University. This is the College Tour. Let's hear from Kara and Jason about their favorite spots on Kane's main campus. Kara was a theater major who found creative inspiration in the changing seasons and natural beauty on campus. Jason was a business management major who is the epitome of student involvement and enjoyed chillaxing to the sweeping skyline views of New York City. All right, you two, take it away. Thanks, Thanks Alex. Alex. Growing up with two sisters, I've always had someone to joke around with. My family tells me I found my perfect career, acting. My experience here at Kane University has been a huge part of my growth as an artist. I make use of the campus's Diangola gym and enjoy scenic walks in either the falling autumn leaves or the blooming cherry blossom trees. Finding creative inspiration anywhere you look. And because we're so close to the city, my roommate and I planned many trips to New York City. I spent most of my time in Vaughan Ames. This building holds many great memories, like performing in my first college play, Alpha Psi Omega induction nights, theater classes, and much more. What about you, Jason? I came to Kane University through the Educational Opportunity Fund program, which helps students from disadvantaged backgrounds, and it has been a fantastic journey ever since. The great thing about Kane is that there is always something going on on campus. I got involved in many clubs and organizations and was voted student trustee on the university's board of trustees and later president of the Student Government Association. The top floor of Heinz Hall is definitely one of my favorite hangout spots on campus because you can sit out on the deck and see the New York City skyline. With the train station right here on campus, my friends and I are able to get to New York City in 30 minutes and many of us have gotten jobs and internships, which is excellent preparation for our careers. I can't wait to return to Kane and continue climbing higher in graduate school. That's, That's it from us. us. Back, Back to you, you, Alex. Awesome, Kara and Jason, thanks for telling us about your best kept secret spots on campus to relax and get in the zone. How ideal that Kane is close to New York City, a worldwide financial and entertainment mecca. Keep climbing higher and best of luck with your future plans. Look forward to seeing Kara on stage and on screen and Jason in the boardroom coming very soon. Let's learn about Kane's cutting edge research opportunities with Hannah. She's a biotechnology molecular biology major enrolled in Kane's accelerated STEM program, earning her bachelor's and master's degree in just five years. A childhood heart condition inspired Hannah's passion to discover new drugs to treat cardiovascular disease. At Kane, she's collaborating with faculty and classmates on leading scientific research. Hannah, tell us more. Thanks, Alex. Howdy, everybody, and welcome to Kane's STEM program. I've always been interested in science since my amazing seventh grade science teacher, and I have been captivated by the medicinal world through drug discovery research. I have a heart condition called HCM, which had sidelined me from athletics at a young age. Due to this, I've always wanted to know more about heart conditions and what to do to help others. When deciding what university to attend, doing hands-on research early in my career was the most important aspect to me. Here at Kane University, I'm able to conduct research in a lab at an extremely early point in my career. 
Being able to work with a partner has truly taught me to be flexible with others, as well as helped me make great friends. I've been doing research under the mentorship of three different professors. My cohort and I synthesized dipeptide protease inhibitors of SARS-CoV-2, successfully coupling two valine groups. Meaning we were able to chemically create a compound that would potentially be able to enter proteins and peptides in COVID-19 patients. I presented my research to my peers at Kane's annual Research Day events, where more than 1,000 other students showcased the work they had conducted. Kane University has been designated as New Jersey's first urban research university. Kane's also on a path to achieve an R2 Carnegie designation, which would recognize our growing research program. Kane has truly prepared me already with a hands-on research experience. Industry recruiters find students here to be more than qualified due to our extensive expertise. I plan on graduating with my bachelor's and master's in science in our five-year program, and then proceeding to get an MD-PhD, researching drug discovery within cardiovascular disease. I am passionate about the research I have already conducted and my future. Bringing it back to you, Alex. Hannah, you are unstoppable. Sounds like your research into new drugs will help create medicines for people to live longer and healthier lives. Incredible that you're maximizing Kane's faculty mentorship, research days, and state-of-the-art laboratory facilities to help get a jump start on your life's work. Here's to you becoming a groundbreaking research scientist. Now introducing Tom. He's an architecture major who knows firsthand about Kane's exciting study abroad opportunities. Tom studied in Rome, Italy for a semester where he became immersed in Italian culture and experienced its renowned architecture. He also enjoyed meeting new people and participated in a design competition centered on renovating Rome's abandoned buildings. Tom, you're up. Thanks, Alex. Ciao, everyone. Ever since I was a child, I've always wanted to visit Italy. When I found out about the study abroad program, I knew Kane University was the right fit for me. There are two non-negotiables when it comes to Kane's incredible architecture program. All first year students have to draw everything by hand, and every student spends a semester in Rome. Studying architecture in Italy is like being a kid in a candy store. Rome is one of the most influential cities to architecture and being able to see everything that we've learned about in our history classes firsthand was indescribable. My classmates and I were immersed in the culture, wandered the city, and even got to engage with the community. While we were there, we entered an ideas competition for our studio project to think of different ways we could turn abandoned buildings into housing facilities. It was incredible. Italy is not the only option. Kane offers over 50 study abroad programs that are open to all students. These programs span across Europe, Asia, South America, and beyond. And if that's not enough, Kane is the only public university in the United States to have a full campus in China. The best part is that there's no extra cost of tuition to study at our Wenzhou Kane campus, and all classes are taught in English. My biggest takeaway from the four months I spent abroad is having the ability to connect with people who aren't like yourself. We live in a globalized world and it's so important to look outward and experience all that the world has to offer. That's all from me. Back to you, Alex. Wow, Tom, talk about an adventure of a lifetime. It sounds like great fun to experience other cultures while earning college credits in your major through Kane's over 50 study abroad programs. And studying at Kane's campus in China for the same tuition is an unbelievable opportunity. Tom, you're now a bona fide global citizen. Take care. Let's catch up with Kobe, who's living large on campus and gives us new meaning to being immersed in college life. He's a communications major, a natural leader who served as both student trustee and homecoming king. Kobe is all about inspiring others to succeed. It's go time, Kobe, you are up. What's up everyone? Growing up, education was always a priority in my family. My mother would have me read and practice math often. Even now, I'm not the best at math, but it turns out I could write and read pretty well. 
This is why I chose to study communications. Through all my years in school, I found that I perform better in smaller classrooms, where the teachers know me by my name. And with education being the highest priority, Kane University was a perfect fit for me. What really sold me on attending Kane University was new student orientation. This gave me the opportunity to spend two days on campus with other freshmen. I was able to make new friends, explore campus, and get an overall feel for the university. That experience encouraged me to live on campus for the next four years. Kane University has some of the best freshman residence halls I have seen. Because I've lived on campus, I've had so many opportunities to participate in clubs, organizations, student events, and activities. Homecoming has always been one of my favorites, and I had the honor of being crowned homecoming king. Being on campus actually inspired me to be more than just a student. So I joined leadership organizations, became a student employee, and even became a new student orientation leader. My greatest accomplishment was serving as a student trustee, representing the student population and working with the board of trustees. Kane's diverse community prepares students for the real world. My next step is to go back to school and get my MBA in business management. While doing so, I want to start a mentorship program and leadership development organization for underrepresented minority communities in New Jersey. My goal is to ultimately give students in these communities resources and opportunities they need to reach all professional fields and increase diversity. Kane has taught me how to work with a diverse group of students, and I want to continue that line of work and foster growth and instill confidence in minority students. Back to you, Alex. Way to go, Kobe. Thanks for telling us how fun it is to live on campus and sharing your amazing commitment to lifting others higher. Your vision for developing professional mentorship opportunities is amazing. You're a powerhouse for sure, and we can't wait to see what you do. It's time to meet Maria. She's an English major who moved to the United States from Bolivia as a child. Maria faced deep insecurities about being the first person in her family to go to college. In Kane's programs for first-generation college students, she connected with faculty and alumni mentors who helped her find her path. We're ready for you, Maria. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. Coming from Bolivia at just six years old with my family, I knew that the biggest challenge for me was going to be learning a new language. When I began my college search as an English aspiring major, Kent University became my top choice. As a first generation student, the pressure to make your family proud is immense. That is why I need a university that will not only help me achieve my goals, but would force the best version of Maria to come out. I can honestly tell you that one of my biggest insecurities was whether I was even good enough for college because of my English. As a bilingual student, your mind would often think in Spanglish mode, and when you're with a friend that is perfectly fine, but professionally speaking, no bueno. Kane professors were key in helping me understand how to use those skills to my advantage. My professors would meet with me, give me advice, and help me become both a better student and a person. Kane University has amazing programs, especially in those moments where you are your own worst critic. The first-gen mentorship programs allow students like me connect with alumni mentors that have been through similar situations but help you guide you in your own path. And every year, Kane celebrates National First Generation Day. The university is even recognized as a first-gen forward institution by the Center for First Generation Student Success. Obtaining my bachelor's degree from Kane University has helped me in more ways than I could have hoped. I no longer feel judged by the world for who I am or where I come from, but because of all the knowledge I have gained through these years at Kane University, I feel prepared for whatever comes next. Thanks, Alex. Back to you. Your story is so inspiring, Maria. It took a lot of courage to overcome your fears and pursue a college education. It's fortunate that you got support as a first generation student at Kane to go for your college degree and make your family proud. Now you're ready to take on the world. All right, everyone, it's time to meet Nate. He's a theater major who balances performing on stage with performing on the basketball court as part of Kane's fantastic Division III athletics program. You're up, Nate. Appreciate you, Alex. How y'all doing? Since I was a kid, I just knew I wanted to play a sport in college. 
When it came down to choosing a school, Kane University opened up the door for me to play college basketball and, believe it or not, be a part of a great theater program. I know. I was able to follow both of my passions right here. Kane has 400 student athletes across 16 NCAA sports. When it came down to practices and training, it was surprisingly easy being able to keep myself motivated and healthy thanks to the phenomenal athletic training and rehab programs. These programs have given me the ability to compete at the top of my game. Since my freshman year, the men's basketball program took me in and showed me the greatest support a guy could ever ask for. Kane's athletic program has allowed me to be part of a supportive community and made the college experience a little easier. Kane University invests in the student athlete experience with upgraded facilities like the pool, the track and turf field, the softball and baseball fields, and the practice gym on the East Campus. Kane has an athletic training facility that is one of the best equipped centers in the state, if not the nation. The support from administration has led to so much success in competition that 90% of our teams are eligible for the playoffs. Being a part of both the athletic and theater programs have allowed me to come into my own. Both communities have allowed me to grow and become rich in experiences and education. They're telling me to exit stage left, so it must be my time. Do your thing, Alex, and y'all be safe out there. Great work, Nate. Thanks for showing us how students can pursue more than one passion at Kane. It's awesome that you found your spotlight as an actor and practice teamwork as a competitive athlete. And the gym and athletic facilities here at Kane are mind blowing. We'll see you on the red carpet or court very soon. Game on, Nate. Get ready to level up with Tatiana. She's a psychology major on a pre-med track. Because of tough circumstances during her high school years, she almost didn't make it to college. But through Kane's Bridge of Success program, she rocked a 4.0 college GPA and is on her way to medical school. Tatiana, please take it away. Thank you, Alex. Hi, everyone. I had a rough start in my journey to college. I did not think college is in my future as I was not the ideal high school student. I had a low GPA and faced a devastating occurrence within my family, which hindered my academic success. My mother had unfortunately suffered a major stroke. Instead of prioritizing homework and the SATs, like most high school students, I prioritized my mother's life. I had almost given up my pursuit to college until I learned of Kane's Bridge to Success program. Without the Bridge to Success program, I would not be in college today. The Bridge to Success program offers incoming freshmen the necessary tools, resources, and support to succeed during their undergraduate journey. During the program's orientation, the director of the program, Ms. Bailey, told each and every one of us we were capable of success. She also told us that we were capable of earning a 4.0 GPA our very first semester. Although apprehensive, I jotted that goal into my freshman planner. Talk about foreshadowing. I sat down with Ms. Bailey and shared my story with her. The reassurance and support I gained from her was what I desperately needed to hear. I knew I was not entering a university that only viewed me as another tuition payment, but as a valued and promising student. A lot of prospective college students are in the same position I was in. We feel our GPA is too low, we won't be successful, and we won't gain entry into college. I want prospective college students to know that they have options. Your aspirations and pursuits of further education should not be abandoned due to struggles and inaccessibility. Kane has many programs, from tutoring to advising, peer mentors, and writing support that help students stay on their path to earn a degree. Kane University has paved the way to my future success. I am proud to report I have a 4.0 cumulative GPA and I am applying to medical school. I couldn't have done it without you, Kane. Back to you, Alex. Wow, you are incredible, Tatiana. It's empowering to hear your uplifting story of overcoming such adversity. It's amazing that Kane helped you get a college education and persevere through the hard times. You did it, and now others know they can do it too. Congrats and best wishes for your bright future. Let's head over to meet Raul. He's a global business major originally from Venezuela. 
Duquesne's Spanish-speaking program, Supera, enabled Raul to attend college while he learned English and acclimated to living in the U.S. Now he's created the Adelante Business Club to help other Hispanic students succeed and reach their career goals. Over to you, Raul. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. I'm from Venezuela. I escaped a political persecution that me and my family suffered there. We came here in the United States looking for new opportunities. I will have the desire to serve people and become a successful business person. I believe we are all interconnected and we rely on one another to really make a difference in this world. I'm a member of the Spanish speaking program, or SUPERA. This program has helped me to learn and adapt to the English language and support me a lot with my transition to the United States. I was even able to take some classes in Spanish at first. This program inspired me to create Adelante's Business Club. We help students find and prepare for internship to help them set up for success. Through the Spanish speaking program and Adelante Business Club, I become a part of the vast and fantastic Hispanic family inside the university. I understand what it is to feel lost around different people, based on your language or even home country. As a Spanish-serving institution, King University, helping students like me, the Spanish-speaking program is here to help you too. Now I feel like home at King University. I will have my first internship as a trader in Bank of America in New York City. I'm confident with my hard work and my new knowledge, I will crush it. That's all for me. Alex, es todo tuyo. Way to go, Raul. It's just fantastic how you connected with the supportive Hispanic community at Kane to help pursue your college education and launch your business career. And it's great that you're encouraging other Spanish-speaking students through your business club. Best of luck for you in your next chapter as a trader in the Big Apple. Let's meet up with Taha. He's a communications major studying media and film who is inspired by the diversity and inclusive community at Kane. Taha's experience of acceptance and camaraderie motivated him to join Kane TV and pursue his dream of being in front of the camera. Taha, it's time for your close up. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. Growing up, I always saw myself as an entertainer but I never really had the school aspect of it figured out. So coming into Kane, I had my guard up, but I was accepted by people who didn't care about how I looked, talked, or dressed. There were even events introducing us to Greek life as well as pride and religious events. I came to Kane as a journalism major because I knew the scope of it could keep me living comfortably after I graduate. I joined a club called Kane TV and they motivated me to fight for my dreams and not take the safe route. And that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm now an aspiring actor and I'm on track to graduate on time. But the diversity aspect of it comes straight from the top here at Kane. Seeing my former principal and vice principal, Dr. Repolette and Dr. Gray become the first ever black president and senior vice president in university history is truly inspiring to me. Kane University is recognized by U.S. News and World Report as one of the most diverse schools in the northern U.S., with over 70% of students coming from minority groups. So three years into my journey here at Kane University, I am currently the most tenured member in Kane TV, and I'm on track to becoming the most tenured member in Kane TV history. And it's all thanks to the diverse groups of individuals who embraced me and accepted me like family. I'm now fully locked in on chasing my acting dreams and getting that diploma. So I guess it's true what they say. Cougars climb higher. Back to you, Alex. Talk about tenacity, Taha. Your story shows us all how important it is to go for what really lights you up in life. So inspiring how the diversity and inclusivity of Kane's community spark you to discover your true dreams and work towards your highest potential. It's showtime for your rising star. 
Okay, we're now heading over to meet Shantae. She's a psychology major who is a natural leader and furthered her career goals in physical therapy through an invaluable internship opportunity. Shantae not only developed her leadership skills at Kane, she worked as a senior resident assistant, peer mentor, and career ambassador to help fellow students find their way. Tell us all about it, Shantae. Thanks, Alex. Hey, everyone. Growing up, I always wanted to attend a school that was sharp in my leadership skills. Kane was the perfect fit for me. Here at Kane, I was able to excel academically while building my resume. Throughout my four years, I was a career ambassador and a senior resident assistant. My favorite part about working on campus is being able to be a mentor and an ambassador for your school. Internships are a vital part of Kane education. The career services staff are here to help you with everything from career counseling to resume writing and interview preparation. During my junior year, I received an internship with a local physical therapy clinic, which helped me fulfill my physical therapy school application requirements and taught me so much. I learned the ins and outs of physical therapy. Being able to see my future during my internship helped me feel confident about applying to physical therapy school. And I got into one of the top physical therapy schools in the country. After graduation, I will be attending Duke University for my doctoral degree in physical therapy. My goal is to continue my leadership skills by mentoring students to help them achieve their goals. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Fantastic, Shantae. Excellent job. It's so impressive how Kane's career services set you up to succeed. Just amazing how your internship led you to discover what you really wanted to do professionally. Congratulations on getting into a top physical therapy doctoral program. We know the sky's the limit for you. Take care. What an awesome day at Kane University. I'm just blown away by Kane's top academics, research facilities, beautiful campus, student diversity, and incredible school spirit. Go Cougars! Kane has everything you need to climb higher towards your dreams. And even better, it's an incredibly affordable public university in New Jersey. Kane offers generous scholarships and financial aid, so a college degree is possible for everyone. I've really enjoyed visiting Kane today, and I hope you have too. Kudos to all the wonderful students and alumni who shared their inspiring stories. These students are really going places. Well, that's all from me, but before we're done, here to wrap up this episode is President Lamont Ruppelet. Cheers, everyone. The students you just met are incredible. They are terrific examples of what we mean when we say Kane Cougars climb higher. I'm Dr. Lamont Rappelet, president of Kane University, and couldn't be more proud of those students for sharing their stories because those are Kane stories. Stories that are full of purpose, grit, and a tremendous Cougar spirit. Kane students are smart, ambitious, and motivated. They recognize that college isn't just about academics. It's about making connections, finding ways to be of service to others, and discover what you're passionate about. I invite you to visit our campus and see it for yourself so you can find your path to climb higher at King. See you soon.